Okoko Bioko, it don't happen again, no. As Judy Austin don't come out, come tell us her own side of the story. And the reason why she agreed to marry your Edoche. And she said nobody can stop them. I beg, I won't make you watch this video to the end. Comment, like, share, and subscribe. It's your girl, Sonzi G's vlog. Good month to you all. And I pray it brings with it everything awesome for us all. Okay, first of all, I want to thank every single one of you. Oh my God. I never knew I had this, <laughs> this kind of fan base all over the world. Like, people were sending me messages. People were, oh God, I just, I love you all. I love you guys. Thank you. Thank you for the love. Thank you for all the support. I can't believe I'm this loved. <laughs> I want to thank you all for that. And, you know, may God bless you. And, you know, I love you guys back, okay? So, mm, I've been wondering, do I tell my story or do I not? You know, there's this saying that uh, there is no smoke without fire and it takes two to tango. But, you know, most times in Nigeria, we don't have that kind of patience to, to hear the other parts. <laughs> you understand a lot of us here we are so frustrated in this country and in, you can't blame anybody the country is so hard for all of us even the rich they complain talk more of you know so it, it, it makes us jump into conclusion without hearing the other party and you know most times it's not really the best thing to do because um i believe there's a reason where uh, when you go to a court for something you know, the judge will listen to both parties before he or she passes the judgment. This is the reason, because if you just kill somebody on just one sided story, you might actually be making a horrible mistake. So that's why I'm asking, do I tell my story or do I not? Now, a lot of people were telling me, no, you don't have to, you don't owe anybody any explanation, just move on with your life. While some other people are saying, um, yes, we want to hear your side of it. We want to hear your story. We want to know what you want to say. It's okay. Now, my question is, if I do tell my story, will people listen to understand me? Or would they just listen to respond? Because it's two different things. It means two different things. When you listen to understand, it actually helps you to know where that person is coming from. It helps you understand why anything was done. When you listen to me just to respond, I can say that, you know, I died and I, I came back to life again, but it won't mean anything to you because you weren't even listening to hear what you just want. Well, I talk, 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 talk. I, you will kill you. <laughs> you understand? So that's just the problem here. Will people actually listen to me to understand where I'm coming from, hear my side of the story? Or would they just listen to roast me? It gets. No. We are all human beings and we all have feelings. You know, nobody ever wakes up and says, okay, fine, I'm going to do this and I'm going to do that. I'm going to hurt this person. Nobody ever does that unless maybe you're a psychopath or something. But if you're actually a human being and I pride myself as one, in fact, not that I'm bragging, but I've never met anybody nicer than me. And I'm saying this authoritatively. I've never met anybody nicer than I am. I know I'm one kind, generous, happy. I think my second name should actually be happiness because I, I love happiness. I don't joke with it and I don't let anything tamper my happiness, no matter how deep it is. I'm always happy because I believe that I have a God that watches over me. I have a God that loves me so much so i'm 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 nice to the core and so because of that I, I think that's actually why i'm feeling like i should tell my story because uh, really is my life you know i can 
I can choose to move on with my life. I'm happy. I'm healthy. Every member of my family, we're all healthy. And by God's grace, we have our businesses that, you know, helps us. So I'm not really lacking anything. I'm actually okay. And God is good in my life. So, but I think it's that niceness in me, you know, that is somehow dragging me to want to tell my side of the story. Even though I know it's not really necessary, but I feel like I should say it. But the only problem here is, will people listen to understand me? Because if no one is going to listen to understand, then what's the point? Do you get? I can just cook my rest now. Let me just rest. Just press my pretty head. You get? So, you know, like, I... Uh, oh, God. My thumb is actually... I'm not eating anything today. Oh, my God. This quest to lose weight will not be here. Sorry. Sorry. Back to it. Um, I just... So, um... You know, so I was just thinking if um, I'm just going to, hey, 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 to God, eh? If we go back, otherwise, okay, money, bujulia, money, bujulia, okay, kai for the So, as I was saying, um. Um, the truth is, my story is actually quite interesting, you know, it's, it's actually something I believe almost everybody would love to hear. And it's quite relatable because I know that, um, so many people have gone through this. I mean, I, 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 I can't be the first person to have experienced this, neither am I going to be the last. This story is something that, you know, it will melt the heart of anybody, you know, that has this kind of experience. Now, I want to tell my story. I really do. You know, if not for anything, for clarity's sake, I want to tell my story. I really do. Because I think it's something that, you know, people might actually learn one or two things from. You know, uh, some people might not like it. It's normal because everybody will never love you. Everybody will not hate you. But I believe that those ones that, you know, would love to hear what I have to say, I believe you, people will learn a lot from it and people will, you know, it will, it will make them wiser. Although they say experience is the best uh, teacher, I believe that. But I also believe that my story would... Um, it will change a lot of uh, mindsets, you know. People would um, probably understand that nothing is black and blue in this life. People think that life is a one-way traffic. I mean, I used to think that too, until life happened to me, you know. Life is never one-way traffic, and life is, is never um, a smooth road. You know, you get it smooth, you get it rough. Sometimes you get it raw for a long period of time before you get it smooth, you know. And I believe my story would touch life. In fact, I, 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 my story is, um, is it's related to that film. Uh, what's the name? Although it's a foreign movie. Hi. Oh, my God. Oh, 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 where's one? I can't remember it now, but I might along the way then I'll say. And I'm, I'm, I'm going to tell this story. I will, I must actually, I must tell my story because it's important for people to hear. At least those, excuse me, those ones that loves me, they need to hear that, you know, that their baby girl is still an angel that she is. Because I know I have just love to give. I have nothing else in my heart. I have love to give. I'm the kind of person that gives people benefit of doubt. If you offend me today, I will approach you. Did I do anything wrong? No. So why are you doing this? If you have a tangible reason, I will understand because I know that no one is perfect. 
if you don't have tangible reason and you are not apologizing, that's when I cut off. So I, I, I pride myself as someone that is worth emulation. Yes, I'm saying it and I'm beating my chest to say it. I'm nice to a fault, actually. People use me, I have all my friends, I mean, I have most of my friends, they use me because, you know, people are users. So, I believe that I'm going to tell this story and people, I pray, they listen to understand rather than to respond. Please, if um, for some reason so you know um if if you think that i should tell my story please indicate you know we have a comment section please say your mind there if you think i shouldn't it's okay still indicate i'll i'll be reading comments you know and if i get more of tell your story then i most definitely will tell my story if i'm getting more of don't then I'll just move on with my life, you know. And because, you know, at the end of the day, God will judge us all. He's the one that sees the heart, not a human. So, and I know my heart is pure, so I actually don't have anything to worry about. But if the comments is telling me to tell my story, I promise I will. Okay? So, um, uh, this is where I spy beat you guys. Mm. 